how to add shapes to a PDF. Transform your plain PDF into a visual masterpiece with ease. Hello everyone, my name is George and welcome back to the official PDF Element YouTube channel. I'm delighted to share with you some tips and tricks today that can help you make your PDFs more interactive and enjoyable to read. Before going any further, may I ask you just a couple of questions. Are you tired of your PDF documents looking plain and boring? Do you want to make your reports, presentations, and forms more engaging and visually appealing? Well, adding shapes to PDFs is the solution that you are looking for. Whether it's arrows, circles, rectangles, or other geometrical shapes, incorporating them into your PDFs can enhance their readability, highlight important information, and make them stand out from the rest. Sounds quite interesting, right? So grab a cup of coffee, sit back and relax because here I'll show you everything about how to add shapes in a PDF to turn your ordinary PDFs into a stunning visual masterpiece. PDFs are widely used for sharing and storing digital documents. As they are easily accessible and maintain their formatting across different devices and platforms. However, sometimes it can be challenging to draw attention to the specific information within a PDF or to provide visual aids that can help explain complex concepts. This is where knowing how to add shapes to a PDF can be a real game changer. By adding shapes such as rectangles, circles, or arrows, you can draw attention to specific areas of the document to make it easier for readers to understand the information presented to them. Today, I'll be guiding you through different ways to add shapes to PDFs by covering the following topics. Number one, benefits of adding shapes to a PDF. Number two, desktop solution, Adobe Acrobat. Number three, desktop alternative solution, PDF element. And number four, online solution, high PDF. Are you ready? Great. So without further ado, let's get started. Part one, benefits of PDF shapes. Adding shapes into a PDF can be beneficial in various situations. For instance, if you share a lengthy PDF with your colleagues or teammates, you may want to ensure that they do not overlook crucial information. Adding a rectangle or circle to a key section of text can effectively draw their attention and prevent them from missing out on any essential details. Or let's say you're working on a project with other people and you're all collaborating on the same PDF. You might want to add comments or annotations to the document to give feedback or suggest changes. By using shapes like arrows, you can easily mark up the document to show where you think things should be modified. And if you're creating PDFs from scratch, adding shapes can be a great way to make your document more visually appealing and engaging. You can use shapes to create flowcharts, mind maps, diagrams, or other types of visual aids that will help you illustrate complex ideas and make your content much easier to understand. It's clear that adding shapes to a PDF is a handy solution to provide visual aids to make information easier to understand for your readers. Fortunately, there are many desktop solutions available that can help you achieve this, such as Adobe Acrobat. Part two, desktop solution, Adobe Acrobat. Adobe Acrobat is the most widely used PDF application globally, owing this to its developers company's pioneering role in creating the PDF file format and its constant innovation. This software offers a broad range of features that cater to the needs of its users, making it an ideal choice for enhancing your documents. With Adobe Acrobat, you can add shapes and other visual elements to your PDFs effortlessly, making your content more engaging and ensuring that your documents are well-crafted and professional looking. Sounds pretty interesting, right? Let's take a look at some of the most valuable shape tool Adobe Acrobat has for you. Adding shapes with Adobe Acrobat is pretty straightforward. Firstly, you can easily add eight standard shapes like squares, rectangles, or ovals. By doing so, you can emphasize and enclose essential information that you want to draw attention to. Secondly, you can add lines and arrows to connect ideas and create flowcharts within your PDF document. In addition to the shape tools, Adobe Acrobat also provides extensive customization options for appearance. You can adjust the color of the fill and borders of your shapes, as well as their opacity and thickness, giving you complete control over the appearance of your visual aids. Finally, another noteworthy feature of Adobe Acrobat is the ability to add comments to your shapes. Simply selecting a shape will open a panel where you can add annotations or comments as needed, making collaboration and feedback a breeze. Adobe Acrobat is undoubtedly a powerful tool that can enhance the readability and visual appeal of your documents, making it easier for your readers to grasp the essence of your information. However, it is not the only recommended software out there. Allow me to introduce to you PDF Element, a 
an excellent PDF editor alternative that might surprise you with its unique features and capabilities. Part three, desktop alternative solution, PDF Element. PDF Element is a great alternative to Adobe Acrobat that makes editing and adding shapes to your PDF documents much easier and affordable. One of the most notable things about PDF Element is its user-friendly interface that reminds us of the smooth experience of using a Microsoft Office software. Even if you're not an expert in PDF editing, you can easily navigate and find the tools you need to make changes you want to your document. Plus, it has a wide range of tools that let you add shapes like circles, rectangles, and arrows to highlight important information or draw attention to specific areas of the document. Professional results at a significantly lower cost. <laughs> Isn't it amazing? Let me show you how easy it is to use. With PDF Element, on the comment tab, you'll find many markup tools, including shape adding tools. With this feature, you can add connecting shapes such as arrows and lines, making it easier to link, prioritize, and connect ideas, or even create flowcharts. One of its biggest advantages is the level of customization it offers compared to other applications. You can not only change the color or thickness of a shape, but when inserting an arrow, you can also modify its appearance by selecting custom pointers. And of course, you'll be able to add conventional geometric shapes. However, that's not all. You can also add unique shapes, such as speech bubbles, making your document look more creative and dynamic. PDF Element stands out for its exceptional ease of use compared to other PDF editing software available in the market. In addition, one of the most notable advantages of PDF Element is its compatibility with a variety of operating systems, including Windows, Mac, iOS, and Android, making it a versatile tool for managing your PDFs anytime and anywhere. To give you a better idea, let me show you how the process of adding shapes looks in the Mac version of PDF Element. On Mac, the shape adding tool is located in the markup section. You'll be delighted to know that the user interface of the Mac version of PDF Element is just as user-friendly as the Windows version, if not more so. In the right panel, you can easily access all the basic shapes along with their appearance settings. This means that you have everything you need conveniently located in one place. And regarding the annotation features, in the markup section, you will also find many tools to share your insights and thoughts. For example, the text callout tool lets you add dynamic square shaped annotations in a flash. PDF Element can serve as an excellent substitute for Adobe Acrobat, offering similar if not more shape features at a more affordable price. While both applications provide options for adding shapes, PDF Element goes above and beyond with a wider range of customization options, making it the better choice for those seeking greater flexibility. In fact, PDF Element offers 12 shapes compared to Adobe Acrobat's eight. So if you're looking for an extensive customization, PDF Element is the clear winner. On the other hand, if you're someone who's always on the go and prefers to work online, you might want to consider using an online alternative for adding shapes to your PDFs. One of the biggest advantages of online tools is that you can access them from anywhere with an internet connection without having to download any software. Plus, they usually offer a range of features that are similar to desktop applications like PDF Element. So let's take a look at one such online tool, HiPDF, and see what it can do for you. Part four, online solution, HiPDF. HiPDF is a free online tool that can help you easily enhance your PDFs. Its intuitive interface is combined with a diverse range of basic functions that can help you tackle any PDF related issues. And of course, HiPDF offers you a shape adding feature to help you create visually appealing and engaging documents. Let me demonstrate for you how easy it is to use HiPDF's shape adding feature. All you have to do is head to the HiPDF official website and upload your PDF through the edit PDF function. Just like in any other desktop PDF application, you can insert ovals, squares, and lines wherever you want in your document. In the same way, you can edit the color and thickness of your figure with just a few clicks. Quite simple, right? That's it for adding shapes with HiPDF. This powerful online tool offers a range of advanced features in addition to the basics, and it's incredibly user-friendly, making it a top choice for all of your PDF editing needs. So next time you need to edit your PDFs out of home, be sure to give HiPDF a try and experience its full potential. Congratulations, now you have the power to add eye-catching shapes to your PDFs. While there are several ways to do this, the three options I've shared with you today are the absolute best. The choice is yours, but I would like to emphasize the customization features of PDF Element and the ultimate convenience of high PDF, which lets you work on the go. So what are you waiting for? Get ready to add some dynamism to your docs and make them more engaging than ever before. Before I say goodbye, I want to thank you for staying with me to the end of this video. If this video was helpful to you, I'd appreciate it if you could like this video and subscribe to our channel. 
I will continue bringing you many more videos like this with tips and tricks to make your work life easier. You can also take a look at the rest of the videos on this channel and there you will find many videos just like this one. Have a great day and I'll see you next time.